Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here on yet another glorious Bagel Sunday. And it is quite glorious. 67 degrees and sunny. The high's supposed to go into the 80s today. I don't doubt it. They weren't supposed to go in the 80s yesterday, and they did. So it was pretty hot. It's going to be another hot one today, but we need to enjoy it because I think well, tomorrow actually might be a little bit warmer and then it goes to shit and then we have like a 20 or 30 degree temperature drop so that's going to be brutal that's okay that's a couple days from now for now gorgeous sunny day out blue skies i know we need to go do some shopping i think that my tracked issues have have flipped the switch in the queen and that uh i mean not that she doesn't always take care of me anyways but she seemed to get really concerned and, you know, has been like 110% about getting good foods and, and, and like making food and stuff for me and making sure that I'm eating and da 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 and all that. And yesterday when we were out and about, what generally happens is if, I mean, I constantly take pictures and, and film. She doesn't like to see it. So the pictures that I took yesterday, she didn't like any of them. And she came upstairs and said that she had ordered some walking shoes and, and some equipment and just kind of left that hang there. So I have wanted her to go for a walk with me forever. And since I have been so unmotivated to actually get off my ass and go for walks, now that she's motivated to want to go for walks, that's motivated me as well. So we're going to go get her some some walking clothing, if you will, today, and, uh, well, and get the hell out of the house. I might not get her out as long as I did yesterday. I was shocked that she stayed out as long as she did yesterday, but we did have fun, and we're going to have fun again today. But for now, let's go get bagels. Bagels gotten. Let's go snarf. Greetings, everyone. Okay. We're here. Yeah. We're going there. Mm. We're doing fun stuff today. We're going to Target. <laughs> Triumphant week stroll out of the Target, having spent money. But we got shit. Yes. Let's go to Pleasure House Point and hopefully see some more damn birds than we did yesterday so that we can test all this stuff out and get some banger shots. Let's go. Okay, so as you can see now today, even massively different from yesterday. A lot of water back. Not floody back, but not also drained and sad looking. Still no birds, but I just started. So let's see what we see. Okay, how have I never noticed this before? It's a shoe. It's like a docker shoe that's overrun with grass. <laughs> Can walk by something a thousand times and just miss it every time. Whew, okay. Again, it's a scorcher out here, and I really haven't seen any birds. Uh, you're going to hear there's a bunch of crows back there calling rather loudly. Nothing I can do about that. And there is a big group of people over there all lining up on this little platform to get their picture taken. So you're probably going to hear that too. Here's one thing i got to say about this past week. It's been a pain in the ass, literally. And, you know, given my problems a week ago, because it was Sunday last week, when uh, all this happened with, with my tract, and, you know, I started having to clean out. So I basically had nothing but fiber all week. And I think I have deluded myself into thinking that, you know, going to three ships and, and, and getting the, uh, you know, the, the freshy, tonicky water type thing, and drinking seltzer water, well, pretty much that's it. That that counts as fluid, and it doesn't. Yesterday, I started to feel a little bit weak. And these little fucking kids are like throwing rocks at, at the, I don't even know if it's a, like a lamp or what, and like these fucking adults aren't stopping them. And we wonder why our freaking world is rampant when adults don't stop kids from doing stupid things. Anyways, so I haven't been drinking enough water is what it gets down to. So I... Uh, yesterday started drinking just plain water because I haven't been drinking enough of it. Today, you know, after we had breakfast, we made breakfast, or I mean, uh, went and got breakfast, at, you know, breakfast bagels, 
See, I can't even talk right. These people are driving me nuts. I don't feel right, and like the weaker I felt. And if I go back into the uh, what little memory I have left right now, I started to realize that, you know what, I think I feel dehydrated. I get that same kind of feeling. So here I am, you know, feeling dehydrated. So I started guzzling water at home. I drank some on the way here, and now I'm stopping every once in a while, and I'm drinking water. And I literally want to use my tripod with the camera in the cage kind of as like a sledgehammer and I want to go over and I want to start beating those fucking people that are throwing rocks at, at that lamp or whatever the hell it is. They're literally, they just keep doing it and these fucking adults are not stopping them. It, it's unbelievable. This isn't me being a you know crotchety old man. It's like, have some fucking respect. This isn't your property, little shitheads. Anyways, all right, I need to go because before I end up going over there and clubbing people, I need to get the fuck out of this area. Just thought I'd give you an interesting view here. I just ranted about the little delinquents that were throwing rocks at the light posts and all the deadbeat adults that were standing around not doing anything about it. But I cut that portion out because I got really, really pissed off. And uh, yeah, I, I, I don't like people messing with my area around here or anywhere for that matter. If you have children, control them. And that's the last thing I'm gonna say about it. Okay, you're shit in your eye. And I got hers too, so I'm gonna head out now and start my Sunday office day. <laughs> okay, clearly back in the studio. Just went through the pictures. I'm just not satisfied with them. Yes, the autofocus came on and it tracked the birds. I had two birds that were flying that I tracked and the autofocus found them and kept on them and everything. The problem is, is that they're just so far away that I don't know that it would have been clear even if I had the other setup, you know, the A7R5 with the 200 to 600. But I have to say, I'm, I've been disappointed more often than not with that setup for birds that are moving. Now, ones that are sitting still that are closer yeah, I'm getting pretty good shots. So that just might be the limitation of this camera and that, you know, it's not a 61 megapixel behemoth with, you know, this crazy AI in it and a 200 to 600 lens. I mean, let's get right down to it. I mean, it's still, I think, a 24 megapixel, 26 megapixel compared to 61. And being able to zoom all the way in on that regardless of whether they're flying or they're sitting there, it, it makes a huge difference, apparently. So I'm going to have to remember that, that yes, while I do have a, a lighter setup that isn't killing my back and neck and shoulders and everything, I'm not going to get as many bangers. <laughs> Disappointing that, that both days that I went, there just wasn't anything out there. I mean, there was one cormorant standing on the post, like way out in the middle of the river, and then the other two birds that I got were in flight. And, you know, I almost never get good shots of them. So I'm, I'm busting up on the camera and, and the lens combination, I guess, more than I probably need to. But it's something that I have to consider that, that if I really want to get great shots, like if I'm going somewhere and I know I'm going to get eagles and it's going to be a once in a lifetime chance, I'm going to have to suffer through carrying the heavy stuff. You know, the, the A7R5 with the 200 to 600 because, you know, I don't want to get home and find out all my shots are blurry. So I'm not even going to bother to post them again. Uh, I need to get started on my office day. I just ate, I guess, late lunch, early dinner, and uh, it's 4.30. So I'm going to get my laundry going, and then I'm going to start doing the day job stuff. Typical Sunday night. So that's all you get for today. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, kids, forward and up.